So I have a Lowe's Cobalt 80 volt um, lawnmower, and it comes with a two amp hour battery. And I figured out that they make a five amp hour battery, which they don't actually uh, display it on the battery, but you can see it's a little bit taller. And uh, two of those batteries replace all five of the two amp hour. So you can take and I think I did a little, no, that's probably the better one. So you can take and, uh, uh, um, and because they don't want you to be able to use them, um, they made the grooves different on the new one. But you can take and cut off what used to be grooves right here you can take and cut that off and it will fit in there just fine it's still 80 volt so and the the uh, ends that plug in are still the same so yeah for some reason they look different size but they're not and uh, so you can just take and slide it right in. You can tell it sticks out a little further than the other battery would, but the lid still shuts. And you can mow, you can mow for two and a half times longer. So it'd be like two and a half of the two amp hour with the five amp hour. And I found these on Granger for 250 bucks each, which is by far the cheapest. And of course you can see they go underneath the name brand Greenworks Pro. This mower is made under several brand names. Uh, Greenworks and Cobalt for Lowe's. Uh, Greenworks is... I don't know who sells that. But uh, the Greenworks Pro has the 5 amp hour batteries. And I would say that a 5 amp hour 80 volt battery is probably only going to be beat, beaten out by uh, steel makes a backpack battery uh, the steel chainsaw STIHL they make a backpack battery that uh, plugs into theirs but I do not believe they make a mower pretty sure they don't but that is probably a better battery um, I have some Milwaukee 12 amp hour batteries that are 18 volt so they're probably you know batteries are hard to to rate based on a lot of things but um, yeah uh, but yeah just want to show that because uh, boy anybody that mows that uses these mowers don't buy a 2 amp hour battery you can find a 5 amp hour and which is two and a half times battery and you can get it for you know not nearly that much more um, I want to say it's an extra hundred bucks even though you'd have to buy two and a half of the other batteries to equal one of those uh, so and Granger was by far the cheapest and the prices really seem to vary considerably Granger being Granger.com G R A I N G E R uh, by far had the cheapest price.
which is odd for Granger because they normally are higher priced than anybody else. So apparently somebody messed up when they uh, entered the price on those for Granger. But uh, yeah, I also found out that there's a huge design flaw in these. You can see there's no cobalt nameplate on the front because I got rid of it. Um, I noticed every time I went to clean this thing, uh, the, the there was just tons of grass and nastiness just coming out of this area. And I figured out this is all hollow. And it was just rusting out the deck. So I took it all apart and then I siliconed all around uh, the front and the edges and uh, to try and, and seal that up so yeah that was definitely a pretty big design flaw and I've got a new blade coming uh, that I want to try um, it's got four blades on it and they laser cut it for you and they said it's the first time they've made one for this and I'll have another video to tell you if it works um, but they're super friendly told me I'd get my money back if it didn't work and uh, I just uh, faxed them a picture of I just basically took my blade off and scanned it in and, and emailed it to them but um, I think they're just going to go to Lowe's and buy that blade so that they can match up these patterns on those hearts and uh, laser cut me a blade that they uh, make just snap in and snap out replacement blades on it and they also break away if they hit something so you don't ding the blade as much you can see that one's a little dinged up and I actually think now this one has a had one mowing on it these blades are really junk and that is a factory blade they really do not take a beating at all they, the steel is just not that hard and uh, but you know if you get the 5 amp hour batteries you silicone off uh, all that so that when grass doesn't get up there and doesn't hold moisture when you wash it out it's actually a very enjoyable mower you don't get the vibration and the noise and uh, you know it's actually not too bad and I'll be curious to see you know with some good American steel that's good and hardened and this new laser cut blade I think this is gonna be a, a really nice mower so uh, I'll have another video and uh, I think that new blade is going to be impressive so and I'll, I'll uh, I don't remember the name those guys I'll post that with the next video that it's going to be the mower blade